Hey guys, Dr. Nesto here with Paige, and today we wanna to go over diaphragmatic breathing, or really just the right way to breathe. The reason why we wanna learn how to breathe with our diaphragm is because when we start to breathe with our chest muscles and our shoulder muscles, it puts a lot of strain on the upper neck and the muscles of the upper back, which can lead to things like headaches, neck pain, tension headaches, etc. And so learning how to breathe with our diaphragm is really important to reduce the stress and tension on those muscles. And so we wanna start out by showing you how not to breathe. So most people, especially during times of stress, anxiety, et cetera, um, are gonna breathe with the muscles of their neck and their shoulders, similar to this, right? Their breathing might also be accelerated or more rapid. And they're using all the muscles of their upper back and chest and neck, putting a lot of strain on the neck and the upper back muscles. Now the right way to breathe is to use your diaphragm. And so you're gonna see that when she breathes correctly, the belly rises as the diaphragm comes down into the abdomen, and then the belly relaxes as the diaphragm comes up. The diaphragm is the most energy efficient muscle to use during breathing. You're gonna get a better breath, more oxygen, and a lot less stress on those little muscles of the shoulders and neck, which can contribute to less headaches, less neck pain, less migraines. So again, this is diaphragmatic breathing. Thank you guys so much and have a great day.